All right, Steve, so let's talk about another big issue uh, with pest control. That's probably roaches. I know roaches are uh, <laughs> hated by everyone pretty much, and I've heard that you know, if there was like a nuclear holocaust, the roaches were probably the last ones alive. So tell us, how can we actually get rid of these very strong critters without using toxic pesticides? Well, pesticides won't, won't kill roaches because if they did, there wouldn't be any roaches because people spray weekly for roaches and monthly for roaches and they spray all the time and they never get rid of the roaches. The simplest way to get rid of roaches that I know of is to go into a room one hour after dark, usually even better yet, one hour after midnight or around midnight. As long as the room is dark, don't have any other lights on, and turn on a red light. Now, with a red light, you can see them, but they can't see you. And you can suck them up. You can vacuum them up. You'll take out 90% tonight. You'll take 6% next week and 4% the week after. Now, if you kill them with anything, you're going to breathe them. And you're going to have cockroach allergens that cause tremendous asthma problems. More kids die in New York City from cockroach allergens than anywhere else in the United States. It's because they put, it's not just the pesticides, it's the rotting cockroach that gets into the air. And that's what happens, something decomposes, gets in the air and you breathe. So you want to remove it. Now, if you're going to remove it with a uh, vacuum cleaner, you want to dry vac, you put just a little powder in there, whether it's talcum powder or baking soda, whatever, just some fine powder because it clogs the spiracles. They breathe through little tiny holes on the side called spiracles. And it's just like putting a plastic bag over your head. You suffocate. Now, the best way, if you can do it, is take a rinse and vac. Because as soon as they go into the soapy water, they're gone instantly. It's very simple to kill roaches. Now, remember something is that any any cleaner, any, any, any cleaner will kill insects better than any pesticide. Ow. Well, soap literally destroys the exoskeleton. If you if you get soap in your eyes, it burns, doesn't it? Okay. If you have an insect and you spray it, they literally. You, I remember a guy had uh, one of the radio television announcers here, television broadcasters was here, and he had been saying he had earwigs on the side of his house. I said, okay. And he had pest control guys come over and spray pesticides. And they couldn't kill the earwigs. And I said to him, I said, do you want me to kill the earwigs for you? He said, what are you going to use? I said, soap. What soap? He said, your soap. I'm not going to buy my own soap. I'm going to use your soap. So you can realize I'm not playing a game with him. I mean, other words, I don't have any doctored soap, you know. In this soap is really DDT or something. It's just simply dish soap. So I took a hose in sprayer and I took his dish soap off the sink and I filled up the hose in sprayer, put it back on the hose, and I sprayed about three foot up the house and three foot on the on the ground. So up like a big yell, I sprayed all the way around. As I as I was walking, they came up by the million, just re writhing in agony because the soap would get into their miracles. Now the listen. The Chinese were the first to use soap, 1100, before the common. They're in there using soap. We have forgotten that soap is the best insecticide there is. Just plain soap. That's why your mom told you to wash your hands when you got done going to the bathroom, playing in the dirt. As it takes out bacteria, virus, it takes out insects. It's the greatest insecticide I know of, soap and water.